looking into the paranormal veil. Death waits for no one when it comes. Purgatory is the spirit's jail. Built behind the blind man's wall. Catch the specter behind the glass. EVPs and disembodied voice. It all happens when the bones are cast. After death, there is no choice. Looking into the paranormal veil. Death waits for no one when it comes. Purgatory is a spirit's jail. Built behind a blind man's wall. Pastors and healers and shamans and poets. We explore the darkened room. Hi, everybody. Guess what? We're here, we're going over to check out Ryan's Bridge because you guys voted for it. So we got two places to go, Ryan's and Heimer's. And look who's with us, Shelly. Hi. Hi, everyone. Yeah, so you excited? I'm ex very excited. Good. That's why I invited myself. Awesome. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, well, you're welcome to every single one if you want to come. Thank you so much. There you go. All right, let's, let's let Bra have a word. All right. There we do. Show my face. Okay. Hello, YouTubians. Yep. Uh, we're coming back to McVickers Creek, so I wanted to follow up with Ryan the last time I was talking to him. I had that conversation that um, he wanted flowers on his grave. So I want to find out some more information if I can as to where this is so we can put the flowers on so we can be at peace. And also, um, as you guys may know, Surf is my son. And when he was here in the exact same spot, he felt like he was physically attacked. And I felt the same thing happened to Ryan. So. I want to see if I can find a correlation between the two of them. And again, you know, people, if you like what you see, what you see right now, just hit the subscribe button, smash on that bell, and you know, let everybody know what us crazy you know, people in Northwest Ontario do. Us crazy connects, as people would say down in the states. Blessings. bad influence on him <laughs> okay uh, right here we get some good stuff sometimes so we're gonna let Shelly try on her by herself just to go down by the rock and try a couple of questions with EVP there you go Hey, right, come over here. Let's have a here. Hopefully, we got something. Look, she got a fancy, dancy speaker and everything. Any spirits here that would like to speak today? Are there any children here?
My name is Shelly. Can you say my name, please? Anybody at all that would like to come and visit and talk? Any closing session? Hmm. Nothing this time. Nothing this time, but hey, you did a good job. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah, did you notice how crazy that swing was going? Uh-huh. I have a painted rock here. I'm going to go grab it. Okay. Yeah, but when she was asking the question, see how crazy that's the swing is going when, before the wind picks up? Rock. Oh, cool! Rock hey. Thunder Bay Rock Group left a painted rock, and guess who found it? Isn't that cute? Look at that. Uh, see, post to Thunder Bay Rocks. Uh huh. Yeah. There and you we go. shall rehide it later. There you go. Um, hello then. Okay, I'm about to give offerings uh, to the spirits. Uh, normally you see us do oranges, but apples work just as well. Apples are actually, you know, like known for this area as well. So the spiritual people are, recognize them easier, you know, truth be told. And they get the juice and the energies and everything else they need. I don't know about the essential uh, vitamins included, but maybe those, those help the spirits as well. My dietitian would agree though. <laughs> so I'm just going to go and put this down on the rock and make an offering. All right. See if you can get a picture of that thing going crazy. Wind died down, swing picked up. <laughs> that, that is so funny. That is. That is pretty cool. The wind, the wind stops. The swing starts. <laughs> the, the wind, st uh, yeah. When it's not windy, it goes like nuts. Look at it. I don't know if you can see that. Well, that is so cool. Okay. You're up. Go ahead. All, all, all right. Um, Shelly was recording as I was giving the offering. And uh, earlier you saw, you know, the swings were, the swing was moving. And I made an offer of the apple. And if you listen closely, we got an answer. I'm not sure where it was now. I gotta try to find it. I think it was before that. Was it before that? Before that. There we go. Right there. I'd like some. 132. Just as I was cutting the apple. See if we can get a picture of that. That's so cool. Well, now that we know that, yes, they do like apples. <laughs> <laughs> so, well, they left the swing, so. All right, so that just shows, yes, they like apples as well. There you go. 
Way to go, Shelly! Right. Hey. My second EVP. All right. <laughs> Way to go! So exciting. Right. What's your name? You, you see this box? If you talk here, everybody can hear you. What's your name? You just like to visit here? Or? Do you know where Ryan is? Does Ryan come here a lot? Okay. Blessings to you. Thank you for stopping by. See you later. I hear it's Jackie. Yeah. He does. Mm hmm Plain as day. Yeah. Do you know where Ryan is? Is Ryan coming a lot? He does. Right there. Mm hmm Hi. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hi. <laughs> yeah, when they said the name, I, I got the E part, so I wasn't sure if it was Danny or Jackie. But yeah. Yeah, yeah. Jackie and Ryan comes here a lot, and she just visits here. Mm hmm. And, uh, and then she said goodbye. Mm -hmm. <laughs> very cool. Very, very. Okay. Okay, Ryan. Uh, Brock came back because you guys had a connection last time. Uh, so we're going to give you a couple minutes. I'm going to pollute the air a little bit. <laughs> uh, we'll give you a few minutes so that you can come and, and prepare yourself for a conversation with Brock. Okay, he's brought his voice boxy thingy. I got my Raptor. We got EVPs. So any way that you, you want to communicate will be fine. Uh, and Brock's got a treat for you. So we're going to give you a treat. And then we're gonna give you five minutes to, to have at it. And then after that, uh, we're here for you, okay? We're here especially for Ryan, okay? So we brought a treat, and it's only for Ryan, okay? And then after Ryan's done with it, anyone else wants some, you know? Let Ryan have one piece by himself, though, and the rest you can all share, okay? All right. Okay. I bring another offering of food. Primarily, this is for Ryan again. I am calling on Ryan to again come and talk to me. I'm here to help you. I'm here to help bring you the peace that you asked for. So I'll give you this offering of food. i give you energy. Other spirits who are here are welcome to it. But please allow Ryan a chance to gain his strength so we can talk. Please, Ryan. I'm here to help you. I'm gonna give you a moment, and I'm gonna you know, call to you again. Hope you're here. Hello again. 
Okay, uh, at this present moment, I'm going to go on the bridge with the Raptor box and see if I can contact Ryan again. As I explained, uh, the main reason that I'm here is to contact Ryan, see if I can get some more information, find out where his grave is. Um, he's, he's wanting flowers on it. He's feeling missed or forgotten. And this will help him you know, reach, reach the piece that he's looking for. So I'm going to you know, do that. The Raptor box works best for me, so this is you know, what helps, so I can understand better. Okay, push that one up when he gets, yeah, okay. And yours. Use both. Hey, Ryan. Pen. Uh, I have a pen, but I didn't bring paper. Yeah, my pen. Ryan, are you here? Okay, I know there's other spirits, but I'm asking for Ryan. Quidditch. Harry Potter fan? Good. Ryan, is that you? I know you were fairly young. Were you a Harry Potter fan? I'm here to help you, Ryan. Are you here? Batteries. No, well, uh, my batteries are good. It means energy. Oh, energy. Well, for the en energy, uh, you know, I brought, a, you know, brought you an apple. Well, Danny brought an apple for you, and I put it out. Did you have some apple? Leverage. Leverage. Well, we're not using as leverage against you. It's not a bribe. I just here, we're, we're here to help you, Ryan. I also have some of the people here the last time. We're all here to help. Haunting. Are you haunting this bridge? Do you feel that you can't travel? Do you wish to look us? There's more of you here. Well, yes. I know there's more of you here, Ryan. But I want to speak to Ryan. Ryan, do you remember my name? Industry. Okay, uh, that came up the last time as well. Do you remember what you asked me for? Do you remember what you wanted? Breath. Did you drown? Did you drown here, Ryan? How about those who attacked you here? When Surf was here, he was attacked. Talk. Yes, I wish to talk. Honestly, I, I want to help you, Ryan. Itself. Itself? Okay. War. War. Do you feel you're in a battle? Uh, the feeling I'm getting what he's trying to say is he was by himself and it was like a war because they were attacking him. Yeah, paranormal. Yeah, uh, yeah. We said that word the last time. Yeah, we, we are paranormal investigators. Even Shelly here is now an official one now. Hey, I'm not feeling you, Ryan. I'm feeling that other spirits. Can someone help me with Ryan? Billy. Okay, now is there a Lily here, or are you talking about my granddaughter? Lily, are you here? Joshua. So a Lily and a Joshua. Are those the children at the picnic? 
Oh, I got Lily and Joshua with me. I'm not looking at Ryan. Okay, let's take a break. Jaden. No, I'm sorry. I'm getting other spirits here. Right, I'm going to end communication. Thank you for, for talking and thank you for helping. But I really wanted Ryan. End the communication time. He was here. Just was the same here. Might have went too far. I think so. Yeah, I gotta back this up. So right there, right there it says I was. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's the only um, actual answer we got on here, on this one anyway, we'll, we'll check hers later, uh, was I was. Actually, that one might have picked it up better, so we'll check that, and then I'll, if there's something on there, we'll show you. Alright, I'm going to try uh, my Raptor box, but I want Bra here because Ryan, for some reason, has an attachment to Bra, so... Hello, spirits. How are you? Good. That's good. Is Ryan here? Hi, Ryan. Hi, Bra. Yeah, Bra's right here. Ryan. Bra wants to talk to you. No. Oh. Oh. Well, that's not Ryan. Here. No, no, that wasn't. Ryan. Uh, can Bra talk to you? Please? Okay. Ryan, we wish to help you. Do you want to help? Yeah? Okay. Okay, Ryan. Last time I was here, you mentioned you wanted flowers on your grave. Am I correct? Did you want flowers? Yeah, remember? A dozen. You want a dozen flowers? A dozen flowers. Okay. Okay. You got you got a deal, Ryan. What name are you buried under? Ryan, what's your last name? Michaels? Ryan Michaels? Ryan Michaels? Okay. Where are you, uh, Ryan? Are you uh, by Balmoro or are you in the other end of town? Can you, can you say that again? Broadway? Oh, Broadway. yes. Broadway. Okay. The one out by the mill. Yeah. yeah, by the mill? Okay. Yep. So, so we're looking for Ryan Mike Michaels at Broadway Cemetery by the mill. Right on? Okay. Mm. What kind of flowers do you like, Ryan? What kind of flowers do you want? Sweet ones? How about carnations? Do you like carnations? Yeah? Particular color? Do you like pink carnations, Ryan? You want a mix? I heard a mix. Mix 
Texas, yeah. I'm thinking like... Okay, we're going to take a break. Be back in a minute. Thank you, Ryan. Thank you. All right, I'm just going to use the rods just to say hi to the spirits. Hello, spirits. Uh, can you show me a yes, please? Thank you. Can you show me a no? Thank you. Uh, there's lots of kids here. Are you having picnics today? You are? Are you with your families? Yeah. Is Ryan happy now? Oh, definitely yes. Yeah? Oh, that's wonderful. So, does Ryan want to talk to, to uh, Bra again? He does. Okay, so basically you want us to come back? Or did you want Bra to talk to Ryan where he's sleeping? Oh, so you want us to look for where you're sleeping? Okay, that's good. Uh-huh. Do you like Shelly? Should we have Shelly as our one of our main investigators? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. oh okay. that's... A, I don't know. Oh, that's better. Okay, <laughs> okay. so do you like Shelly? Yeah, you like Shelly? That's good. Thank you. Yeah. You got like three guys. Oh, three people like you. Well, that's nice. <laughs> do you like me? Oh, that's... That's not that. Oh, look at that. Holy catfish Jones. Oh, my God. Wait, wait, are you guys finally on my side now once? <laughs> <laughs> you were on Bra's side? Oh, no. Oh, jeez. <laughs> uh, okay, so you don't like me, huh? I see how you are. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right. I love you guys, dude. They're just teasing now. <laughs> okay, I'm going to let Shelly give this a try, okay? Will you talk to Shelly? You will? Okay, let's give, let, let's, let's her have a try, okay? Okay. Okay, so I'm going to teach you how to use first things first. Whenever you use a rod, keep your elbows right on your side. Okay. And then you put mm -hmm. your knuckles together. That forms a triangle, see? And then that way, you don't move or anything like that, right? Keeps everything nice and still. Now, pull my finger apart. Which one? Anyway. This one? And I'll pull the top one. You loose, yep. You all loose? Yep. Okay, so that's when you want to hold it. Okay. Then when you put them together, start with your baby knuckle. And just roll your hands in like that. And then just let them sit still. Okay? So I'm on the side. No I'm touching. Yeah. And they're supposed to rest on my fingers? Yeah. Put them right there. Mm -hmm. Nice. Okay, so now can you show me a yes? Can you please show me yes, spirits? Oh, they're trying to move. Okay, let me get a little bit more comfortable. Yeah, find the find comfort. Find the yeah. And they're yeah, supposed to be straight, right? Yeah. Like this? I just want to make there sure we they're, go. Whoop, okay. make, make sure they're level. Yeah, let's try to make sure that they're as level as possible. There you go. Okay. Can you show, can you show us a yes? Can you please show me yes, spirits? Come on, you can do it. I know these are Danny's rods. I'm just borrowing. Yeah, it's okay, spirits. You can talk to these rods. Before. Can you show me a yes, please? Same with you, they're just crazy, eh? They just... Well, what it is, the more you do it, the more... Yeah. It's not just a tool they got to get used to. They got to use to your body. That's right? right. Absolutely. I'm also a firm believer that they're very tuned to you, Danny. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, that's just it, right? Yeah. Okay, show yes. Come on. How about I put my hand here? You sure yes? Oh, there we go. You're trying. Oh, there we go. There we go. There. Good job. Yay. Now you know how to do it. Yeah, they're more attuned to you, eh? Which is okay. I mean, it's really neat to try. There's a deer down there, too. Oh. It's visiting. Yeah, but well, anyway. Yeah. That's okay. Uh, the main thing the main thing is I want you to know how to hold them. Okay. Right, so at the sides, mm -hmm. bring your knuckles together. Let them sit. Hey, spirits. <laughs> okay, so uh, just let them sit, and that's it. 
you know, men even ask the questions and stuff like that. So who do you like better? You like me better than bra, right? No? Oh, you, you, like, you like bra better? Yeah? Oh, that's a big guy, dude. I see how you are. Okay, no more cookies for you. Well, I was going to give you a cookie, but now you don't deserve a cookie. Oh, yeah, you do? You do deserve a cookie? Oh, well, you're not getting one, so too bad. All right, I was just kidding. I don't have a cookie. So, I was, I was, I was kidding. All right, Spirit. Uh, thank you for talking to us, and we'll see you again, yeah? Yeah. Okay, bye-bye. I had a fantastic day today. I learned some more stuff. I got multiple EVPs, which I'm super excited about. So when I go home, I'm going to listen to them. Really excited and another great little investigation with these wonderful gentlemen. So I just want to say thank you to Danny and to Bra for a wonderful, another wonderful experience. Hello, YouTubians. We're coming to the end of the investigation. And firstly, I'd like to say Thank you to uh, the spirits that finally decided they like me now, <laughs> you know, over Danny. Uh, finally, uh, the good-looking one gets some kudos. <laughs> <laughs> and again, um, okay, now we did find out, like, you know, the reason for I wanted to come here today was find out more about Ryan. Found out his first name, last name, and where he is, you know, where he's resting. So we're going to bring him uh, some peace so he can, you know, be happy in uh, the afterlife by bringing flowers to his grave. Just gotta find out exactly where where that is, and yes, we will bring you guys with us. Uh, again, if you guys have any further information about Ryan or this area and what happened here, please you know let us know so we can you know tell Ryan you know some more information. So again, YouTubians, um, again hit the, the bell, subscribe, let uh, your friend you know friends and family know about us, uh, and again, if you have any suggestions, we'd be more than happy to take it. And if you forget, I'm Bra, the spirit's favorite. All <laughs> have a good day. Peace and love. Hello, my YouTubians. Uh, we've had a great day. I, I'm in my ghost mobile today. I brought my ghost chair out. Uh, yeah, so, you know, it's a good day. Uh, don't forget, tomorrow we're going to Heimer's. Uh, so we'll be bringing you episodes of that. We're going to try to find this, uh, this grave marker and put some flowers so that's good and I really like to thank the ghosts uh, from the bottom of my heart uh, for helping me to mend Bra's psyche uh, him, you know not 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 feel the love and everything else uh, he really needed that today because therapy bills cost me a mint you know and uh, but so I want to thank you for letting him be the favorite today I really appreciate it you shouldn't uh, lie to the spirits you know so so you know just to the spirits <laughs> thank you for that all right and now remember everybody, all right? Take care of yourselves. Take care of your family. Watch out for ghosts. And have a great day. Bye. Okay. Uh, Shelly was reviewing her EVPs, and we got a good one. We got a Class A. Uh, it's definitely not broad speaking, and it's definitely not me. And you can tell it's not broad because there's not even a breath in between the sentences. So Bra would have to be a, a fast speaker, and he's not. But anyway, listen to this. Asked for. So I give you this offering of food to help you. Right there. Okay, right. back it up one more time. Mm -hmm. So I give you this offering of food to help you. Give you energy. Class A EVP. Yeah, your first Class A. Another good one on my new recorder. <laughs> <laughs> I got a good one for you. You got a good one? Yeah. Okay. Four of us went out fishing one day, and it was went out to this one lake up way up Spruce River Road. Okay. And about, yeah, I don't know, about two or three in the morning, got up. Went outside, and I could hear this music playing, country music playing. Okay. So, that morning we got up to go fishing. Mm -hmm. Went around the whole lake, there was nobody there. And wow. Went to, and we were, well, parked about a half mile away. We walked down there and thought maybe somebody else pulled in the camp there. Mm-hmm. It was only our vehicle was there, that's it. And you heard singing? 
Nope, just country music. Oh, country playing. music playing. Oh, wow. No singing, just country music. Wow. I don't know where the heck it came from or what. Very cool. Another mystery, eh? I went around the whole bloody lake and tried to think of maybe somebody else might be camping on an island or something. But and nobody, eh? Not a soul. Ladies and gentlemen, children of all ages, we bring to you Danny of Seabass trying to you know, leap over a dead leaf in one single bound. We await. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't get no air! <laughs> and he didn't hit a tree either. Tune in next week, folks, when you hear Danny say. Looking into the paranormal veil Death waits for no one when it calls Purgatory is the spirit's jail Built behind the blind man's wall Catch the specter behind the glass disembodied voice. It all happens when the bones are cast. After death, there is no choice. Looking into the paranormal veil, death waits for no one when it comes. Spirit's jail. Built behind a blind man's door. Pastors and healers and shamans and poets. We explore.